Hi, my name is Eva from Ananya Yoga Vienna. I'm happy to introduce you today to a pranayama technique, maybe not so well known. It's a technique actually we find already in the Hatha Yoga Pradipika or in the Garanda Samhita. Both texts are a few hundred years old, so the Hatha Yoga Pratipika it's about 700 years old and the Garanda Samhita about three, four hundred years old. In both texts where about eight pranayamas are mentioned, that specific pranayama is mentioned. Maybe because of its importance. So it's a technique where we breathe in through one nose thread and exhale through the other and in between we keep the breath. So we will inhale through the right nose thread we will then keep the breath and exhale through the left. The pranayama technique is called Surya Vedhana. Surya is the sun. So it's a sun technique. It's an activating technique and uh, it's uh, similar to those we already know like uh, Nadi Shodhana where we it's a cleansing technique for the Nadis. But we only inhale through the right and exhale through the left. We can choose a rhythm like uh, 4 for the inhalation, 16 for keeping the breath and 8 for the exhalation. Also we can include bandhas. So in Anasara Yoga we don't make the bandhas too hard. So we more or less let them show themselves when we use our UPAs. So for that specific pranayam, we need Jalandhara Bandha, which we just can use while we bring our chin to the chest. So just relaxing the chin down to the chest. Sometimes it's taught by really pressing it down, but it's too hard as we only use it as energetic locks and not so much a physical lock, we just bring the chin down to the chest and lengthen the back of the head up so that we keep here the bandha, the lock, but not make it too strong that we harm ourselves. And we use another Udihana bandha. Udihana bandha, we use it here just by when we exhale pulling the navel in, in the direction to the spine and then keeping that and when we inhale again we are releasing it and inhale back in the belly. So those two bandhas we need for the uh, pranayama and additionally we can use a mantra. So when we inhale we use hum. When we exhale, we use sa. So it's hum sa, the mantra. Okay, so how do we start? We will start inhaling completely. Then we can relax already the chin to the chest for a moment. Then we lift the chin and exhale through the left. And we start with inhaling through the right, keeping the breath and exhaling to the left. We do that for nine rounds. Okay. So find a good pose. What is a good pose? You can sit on your heels, in Vajrasana, that's a very good version. Or you ju can just sit cross-legged on the floor it's also possible to just sit on a chair, but then please keep your feet on the floor. Okay, let's give it a try. So, close your eyes. What's important here is also that you try to lift your sternum and relax your shoulders. We tend to, to bring the shoulders up, so try to relax them. You don't need to push them back here. So just relax the shoulders. Bring your left hand in Jin Mudra on the left knee 
and the right hand we use for Vishnu Mudra. So just bring all hands in, stretch out the small and the ring finger and also your thumb and you will close with the right thumb your right nostril and with the right ring finger you close your left nostril. So relax the hand on the knee. Close your eyes and for a few moments just observe your natural flow of breath. I love to start all my pranayamas with a focus first on the natural breath. It doesn't need to be that long. And now inhale through both nostrils. Keep the breath, relax the chin to the chest. Keep the breath. Lift the chin, close the right nostril, exhale through the left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale through the right. One, two, three, four. Jalandara Banda, keep the breath. Fifteen, sixteen, out to the left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale right, two, three, four. Keep the breath, Chalandara Banda, bring the chin to the chest. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, lift the chin, exhale to the left, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale right, Two, three, four. Keep the breath, Chalandara Banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin. Exhale through the left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale right. One, two, three, four. Keep the breath, Chalandara Banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Exhale through the left. Lift the chin. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale right. One, two, three, four. Keep the breath. Set Chalandara Banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin. Exhale through the left. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Inhale right. One, two, three, four. Keep the breath. Set the banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Exhale through the left and feel while you're exhaling, you set Udiana banda. Inhale through the right. One, two, three, four. Set Chalandara banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin, exhale left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale through the right. Keep the breath, set the Jaladara Banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin, exhale through the left. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. Inhale right. Two, three, four. Keep the breath. Set the banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin. Exhale left. Feel Udiana Banda working. Seven, eight. Inhale the last time through the right. Keep the breath. Set Jalandara Banda. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Lift the chin. Exhale through the left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Release the hand to your knee. Close your eyes if you haven't already. 
and take a few moments to feel the benefit of Surya Vedana Pranayama. Take a few moments and let your breath get back to its natural flow. For me that always takes a little time. And also take your time to feel how you feel now after the pranayam, what's going on in your body, in your emotional body, in your mental body, and also in your physical body. And I encourage you to work with that pranayama and feel yourself the benefits of that. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me. Oh.